this is Michael Gatewood and this is Digital Essentials. In this particular exercise, what we're going to do is we're going to do color for emphasis. This is a technique of turning an image black and white and bringing back parts in color. What we're going to use is an adjustment layer. An adjustment layer allows you to be able to go in and through a non-destructive process, create an adjustment layer that will allow me to be able to turn the image black and white and bring back parts in color using a mask. Adjustment layers are a part of the layers panel and there are a lot of options, not just this technique. What we're going to do is the adjustment layer, color for emphasis project. We're going to go into the bridge and we're going to double click on the image. Once we've done that, it goes into the raw graphic interface. This particular shot was shot in the raw format. What I'm going to do is I'm going to simply open image and bring it directly into Photoshop. Now, what I'm going to do is position everything, go into my windows, go into my workspace, and reset for photography. What we're going to do now is we're going to grab our channels, or excuse me, our layers, and double click on the base layer. What I'm going to do is I'm going to call this, hmm, man. And then what I'm going to do is go to an adjustment layer, which looks very much like a black and white cookie. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click on that particular graphic and go to black and white. Perfect. Now I want to let you see that in layers we can simply go in here and change our opacity making it look slightly desaturated. That's a neat effect. But what I'm going for is true black and white. We can also go to our adjustments layer and we can adjust our reds to get, well, a little less density. Something that looks well, more gray than black. We can adjust all the colors using an adjustment layer, and we also have a mask. Now, with a mask and an adjustment layer, you automatically get one. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to be able to use this just to bring back the parts you'd like in color. What I'm going to do is I'm simply going to go in here with this white mask and go to my brush. And I'm going to go with a black brush. White reveals, black conceals, and what I'm going to do is simply go right around the hat on the Mad Hatter. What you're seeing is a selection that we're doing just with that part of the image. White reveals, black conceals, and what we're getting is we're getting an effect that's going to allow us to tone this image down just a little bit and have one part pop. This is going to be the red hat. Now the great thing is it's non-destructive. I can turn the layer visibility off and on. I can throw it in the garbage can. Command Z is undo. I can bring it right back. This is an excellent way to do color for emphasis. Great for weddings, events, product displays, advertisements, all kinds of wonderful things. And this completes this exercise. Thanks for watching.